So here's how to activate the international market in Shopify. It's very easy to do and you can follow along with me right now. In fact, if you'd like to log in, I will leave my link down below in the description for easier login access. So when you run your main dashboard, if you look at the left side of the screen, all the way at the bottom, we have the settings with the gear here. Simply click here. Now, once we are here, make sure you take a look at the left side of the screen right here. You're gonna notice we have markets, right? It's right here on my screen. It might be a little higher, might be a little bit lower depending on if they add new sections here, but let's click on markets. And this is gonna be almost the last step. You're gonna notice we have the US of A right here under primary for active, but under inactive, we have international. Let's simply click right here. And it's a very easy process. All you really need to do here is go to inactive and make sure you click on active. And once you're done, also very important, make sure you simply click on save as well. Okay, now given the fact that the international is all set up, make sure that you can manage the payment methods that you accept worldwide, like PayPal is a good one. And of course, when it comes to taxes, I'm not sure where you're gonna be located or selling to, but obviously go through and manage that. So you can make sure that at least you're gonna be accepting payments, right? And if you need to collect taxes, that you need to do that as well. That's gonna be a completely different tutorial. This is just about how you can activate the international markets. Very easy to do as I showed you in this tutorial. And if it helped you out, be sure to give it a thumbs up as it helps me out a lot as well. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.